Our credo is M-O-B. That's not money over. You know what I mean? I'm talking about mind on Bible. Amen. 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 Ah, see, in a few short weeks, we'll show you all the essentials you need in running your church, right? Like name selection. Name selection is very important in running your church. You have to pick a name that's more than nine syllables. Count it. One, two, three, four, nine syllables. Like greater, Ebenezer, faith of a mustard seed, Baptist Church of God in Christ. See, now that's 12 syllables right there. That's good. I need to write that one down. Wait a minute. Ah, later. And see, we teach you all these steps that will help you boost up your sermons, which will bring in more people, which brings in more tithes, which brings in more money. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Brings in more souls to be saved. Amen. Because at church, we're not about the money. No, not us. Mm -mm. We teach you techniques like coughing. He did it for you way over there. Yes, he did. He did it for all of us. Amen. He made our lives better. Amen. 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 Coughing emphasizes your words and makes your word that much stronger. Amen. Amen. Then there's profuse sweating. You got to feel it, cause he's in here. He is. Can I get an amen? Oh, y'all don't hear me preaching up in here. Can I get an amen? Can I get an amen? Oh, it's hot in here. Deacon Joe, turn on the AC. I'm about to burn up. It's so hot up in here. That's cause the sermon is hot. Cause see, if you sweat, that shows that you're hot. That your word is hot. And then they will believe that you're hot. And that's bringing them in. I like that. Amen, amen. Also, you have to know how to sing just a little bit. You have to know how to carry a note like, ha, ha, that works. Did it? Because we are all sinners. Amen. You a sinner. I know you sin. I seen you sin. I seen you. I seen you at the strip club with a dollar in your hand. Putting it in that crack. And I'm not talking about the white stuff. I'm talking about the booty. See, because when you sing, you get them involved, and then they start enjoying the sermon. Amen? Amen. Then, you also have to know your time. Because if you run too long, people get mad and they leave. Then you lose money. I mean members. And you don't want that to happen. So, you get your watch, and when it's three minutes to go, that's when you add in all these techniques to make the super sermon. Amen. Amen. That's right. And there's many more things I have to say about that. But, but uh, you see, uh, you got to be on his side. If you want the blessings to come down, uh, the praises have to go up. Amen, church. You see, you got to be with him because uh, if you don't, uh, you're going to see, uh, you're going to see not him. You're going to see him about glory. You got to, you got to move, you got to shake with them, you got to, you got to give them thanks every day, children, yes you do, I thank them every day, I thank them for my cars, I thank them for my house, I thank them for the G5 on 26s, yes I do, I thank them for all the fly women that I run into, yes I do, I just thank them every day, cause it's been good to me, I know it's been good to you, whew, and uh, whew. With that being said, I'm going to open the doors of the church. Come on down and get some bread. And those are the few things that we can teach you here at the Ed Began School of Ministry. So if you can, if you want to, if you want to start your church and you want to get people to come and you want to get all that money, I mean all them souls saved, then come on, give me a call, 1-800-ED-BAGANS. And we can get you into a class right away so you can start your church right away. Amen. Bring that
collection plate over here. I need to count that last week's money. <laughs> What's up, my people? I said, what's up, my people? It's Ghetto TV, you bastards. You got to have this. <laughs> yeah.